There I was in the hospital bed during childbirth, in between contractions, working. IV in one hand, iPhone in the other. No, really, that's true. While I loved working in media, I knew I needed to make a change. I didn't want to be the cliche career woman boss lady who never sees her kids. But figuring out what I did want and how to get there, that's taken me on an epic journey. I'm now the main character in a story I can't put down. Let me back up. When I was a kid, I was always very creative. I had a successful jewelry company for many years. I graduated from Penn, then spent a year backpacking around the world by myself. Yeah, it was kind of amazing. When I came back to New York, I spent more than 15 years in media. Our Kim Ritberg has a story. Writing and directing for TV news, business, and lifestyle shows. I worked at Netflix and People Magazine. I covered everything from presidential inaugurations to red carpets. My hand is quite famous. <laughs> and I launched the first ever video unit for Us Weekly. I oversaw all the operations and creative. I am here with executive producer Kim Ripper. Our videos performed really well and made a lot of money. When the company sold for $100 million, the video unit was a big selling point. It was a career high. But when I left the hospital with my newborn and decided to build my own business, I had to step into founder mode. And I realized I was accomplished, but anonymous. To stop being the world's best kept secret, I had to market myself on social media. But I felt self-conscious. Despite having trained tons of people to be on TV, I also felt unclear on what to make, despite being a media executive and having made hundreds of hours of content for national TV and social media. But I had to push through my self-limiting beliefs. I created a strategic content framework and showed up with a crystal clear message consistently on video across social media. I stopped hiding from the camera and from clients, and my business exploded. I now speak on stages across the country. I've been featured in major publications, including Forbes and Business Insider, and I've won six awards for two nonprofit video projects. It's been so gratifying, but it's not just about me. I now want to share my knowledge and experience to help fellow business owners expand their impact, visibility, and revenue through video and podcasts. My framework takes you from professional to thought leader and from business to brand through content. I work with clients on messaging, on-camera media coaching, and video and podcast strategy. And the results are staggering. One client signed three contracts directly from social media. Another landed a Fortune 500 speaking gig Yet another built a huge referral business because of his videos. My clients frequently get speaking engagements, partnerships, leads, and clients from their social media. And I love being part of their aha moments, the mindset and skill set shifts that expand their confidence and revenue. And for me, the best part of this path is that I found my purpose.